SLY thief. Kate brutally slapped Meghan down after trying stole the show to get closer the crown. Meghan Markle appeared in a stunning red Carolina wearer gown on November 10, in what was widely seen as the most glamorous of all her looks. Meghan Markle's bold red look on the red carpet at the Salute to Freedom Gala, in some respects, may have been an attempt to make headlines across the world, just like Kate Middleton did at the James Bond premiere. Kate wore a dazzling gold Jenny Packham gown on September 28 at the premiere of No Time to Die, the latest James Bond film starring Daniel Craig. Royal fans went into a frenzy after seeing Kate's dress, with Twitter accounted Katie's royal of tweeting, this is how you do it. This has got to be one of the Duchess of Cambridge's best looks. However, it is difficult to know whether Meghan made the same impact in her beautiful red ball gown. Dana Barrowman, marketing manager at Jewelry Box, seems to think so, and exclusively spoke to about how Meghan stole the show. She said, the Duchess of Sussex's New York wardrobe, worth a reported total of over £60,000, has been making international headlines for all the right reasons, but, her jaw-dropping red dress moment at the 2021 Freedom Gala is undeniably the most glamorous of all her looks from the trip. Duchess Meghan stole the show in a ravishing red Wes Gordon for Carolina Herrera pre-fall 2022 ball gown. She wore her hair in a slick high bun and stuck to very minimal nude makeup, balanced out by sharp eyeliner. Both the Duke and Duchess of Sussex sported poppy pins in honor of Remembrance Day in Britain. Now, with no palace dress code to hold her back, the Duchess has been able to really re-embrace her spectacular sense of style. She has a long history of backing feminist and female-led causes, long before her royal initiation, however, since becoming royal, she has been using her clothes and jewellery to make strong statements of support. The Duchesses of Cambridge and Sussex are two very different women, both of whom can hold their own in the public spotlight. While Duchess Kate, once a commoner, has had to be trained on her public image since stepping into the royal family, Duchess Meghan's former career in show business and lifelong exposure to the media has, in a way, equipped her for royal life from the get-go. Princess Diana would surely be proud. The data revealed that searches for gold dress exploded 92% in the UK on the September 29th, one day after Kate revealed her gold outfit. Everything about Kate Middleton's outfit on the night of the No Time to Die premiere emphasized her royalty, which is particularly fascinating considering how popular she has made herself by her elegant thriftiness, her multiple recycling of outfits, for example, the McQueen coat she re-wore on Harry and Meghan's wedding day, and refusal to upstage the royal order of rank. Rumors of rift between Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton have been circulating for several weeks, after multiple royal insiders have come forward about their relationship. Now people are accusing Meghan of copying Kate when it comes to her wardrobe, and royal staff are said to be baffled by it. The glamorous Duchess of Sussex is no stranger to the world of fashion, and has been known for her glossy red carpet looks and teeming smart blazers with trousers, inspired by her character in suits. But since joining the royal family, she has has understandably gone for more traditional looks, opting for long hemlines, formal coats and timeless shades suitable for the events she attends. These changes in her sartorial choices have reportedly been interpreted by some as examples of Meghan copying Kate's style, and staff are allegedly miffed about it. A source told, it hasn't gone unnoticed by Kate's circle. Everybody is a bit baffled. Meghan was a style icon and knew what to wear. But since joining the royals she seems to be a bit lost. Instead of finding her feet she is copying what Kate wears more often than ever. Kate always looks stylish. She has been in the family for years and knows the protocol. So it makes sense that Meghan would look to her for inspiration.